update related to one of the biggest capital murder cases in recent Smith County history. The defense team for former nurse William Davis was in court today accused of harassing jury members connected to their client's trial. Their client was sentenced to death by a jury in 2021 for killing four patients. The sentence triggering an immediate appeals process. KTK's Ashlyn Anderson was in the courtroom today and has more about the accusations and the judge's decision. Please be seated. Thursday afternoon, the defense team of convicted killer William Davis is now on the defense. I think it has to be done within the bounds of just basic decency. And it sounds like that's not what's happening here. Judge Reeve Jackson says the court has received numerous complaints of, quote, harassment toward members of the jury and their families. I think perhaps most egregious of all, there was an incident where members of the defense team uh, were, quote, harassing the elderly parents of a juror at the assisted living facility where that juror's parents resided. And that frankly shocks the conscience of the court. He says the defense does have the right to attempt contact, but not in that manner. If they decline to comment, we have to respect that wholesale. If they don't want to be talked to, that's the end of the story. So showing up any other way than that is a problem. Based off of the complaints made against the defense team, Judge Reeve Jackson said these actions are, quote, totally inappropriate and outside the bonds of decency and courtesy. But he declined to impose sanctions on the attorneys, instead issuing strict orders for them to follow. No member of the defense team shall make any further attempt to contact any member of the jury without first seeking and being granted permission from the court to do so. And I want to be clear for the record, this is the first time that we are hearing of any of those facts. Litigation experts say jurors already have a hard job in many cases and they deserve to be protected. And the integrity of that process and your security and privacy becomes paramount to respect what you've done uh, as a juror. Meanwhile, William Davis's death sentence is making its way through the state appeals process. Ashlyn Anderson, KTK News.